different people from different countries came together in America. There's like multiple stations where everyone, you get to like learn about the country that you're talking about. We've been to India, we've been to South Korea, we've been to Japan. So the school gives every child a passport, which is a fun thing for the ch children. They are trying to explore different countries because right now we can't go to each and every single country in place. And like these, you get to like get some stuff that they have in that country. My country is Japan. I love spinning tops. Like how Japan has origami. Origami! But my favorite was South Korea. It shows you like different things about Korea. Like it'll show you some popular sports in Korea and you get to try them. We got to kick these little balls. We try to keep them up in the air and like people people um, are really advanced at it and they just they kick it with the side of their foot and they try to keep it up in the air. Well China is right behind me and there's these cool like picture boards and you get to put your face in you get and they take pictures of you and you get to like act like you're the character that they're taking the picture. Well I've been to India. It's called Mahendi in my language but actually in the original form it's called henna. So the kids love it and it's kind of like our way to have a lot of jewelry on. The teachers love it. They they are the first ones to come. <laughs> and you really get to like learn about all the different types of country around. It's better to experience them just instead of reading them from books. We love the International Day in Canberra. It's just amazing. Whatever happens here today is just an amazing day. The kids wait for it. We mothers wait for it once a year. It's really fun. We don't get to do it that much, and I just think you get to learn a lot about all the countries.